Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the Isle Casino and Hotel in lovely Black Hawk, Colorado. So far, so good. This place is awesome. Nice, big, clean, state-of-the-art casino. First off, it's time to go eat. It's early and we hungry. Hey, y'all. He has collected me, and we are going to go and check out our first contender in the, the battle of the Black Hawk breakfasts. And today is Mardi Gras Casino. So the cafe is located on the third floor of the Mardi Gras Casino. So we just took a quick break to show you this as we walked over. Thought it was kind of neat, kind of cool. So now we're gonna go stuff our face. Absolutely. Then there was that. Crap! <clears throat> what are we supposed to do? We're gonna starve. We're gonna starve. It's very inconsiderate. I'm gonna have to give a bad Yelp review for this property. <laughs> My name is Karen, by the way. Or Becky. The uh, Bourbon Street Cafe at Mardi Gras Casino. I thought I had researched this thoroughly, but apparently they don't open until 11 o'clock on Thursday mornings. So they said, go down to the Full House Cafe. So we went down to the Full House Cafe. The cook had just shown up. They were supposed to open at nine. It's now about 9.20. Uh, so he said, well, give it, give it to about 10. Well, sweetest darling, we have a schedule. So here we are at the Red Dolly Cafe, I guess it may is called. Here in time for breakfast, they have uh, the usual two egg breakfast called the jackpot for $5.50, which consists of two eggs with uh, hash browns, choice of uh, bacon or sausage uh, or grilled ham. Then they have French toast, two slices for five bucks, pancakes, five bucks, biscuits and gravy for 50, build your own omelet, three egg omelet for $7.99, uh, a breakfast burrito for $8.99 and the mother load steak and eggs, which is a six ounce sirloin with uh, two eggs, any style, hash browns and toast for $14 or $13.99. Then they have a couple of skillets, you know, where they mix up all the good stuff with the hash browns and serve it all together. There's a country skillet, there's a Southwestern skillet, and there is a Denver skillet, which is mainly, you know, what, uh, ham and veggies. So it all sounds very good. Hey, they got such sides and such mm. you know stuff like one egg side of bacon extra toast well, extra like extra that. yeah all right well it all looks good all right so we're gonna decide and we'll hit you back when the food gets here it'll be a surprise breakfast has arrived i got the usual two eggs two pieces of bacon two hash browns 42 11 pieces of toast looks wonderful which um, one was this one called again? The jackpot. Oh, uh, yes. So he got basically the same thing I got, except for with bacon. He got his with ham, and then he got an French. order of Vrange dough. <laughs> Vrange mm. dough. So we're going to dig in here, and uh, we'll hitch back and let you know our final thoughts. I'm reaching for the pebble. So we just got finished with breakfast. Again, that was the two jackpot breakfasts. Uh, also, an order of <laughs> which was four ninety nine. The jackpot breakfast were five fifty each. We both got water, and the grand total is seventeen dollars and forty one cents for that great big breakfast. So two for ten for value. Is it fancy? No. Does it have to be? Absolutely not. It's breakfast food. You know how fancy? How fancy do you need it? Service was wonderful. The service was really good. Overall really happy it, it was a hike up here so you guys if you're if you're deciding to make the walk from down say monarch or isle casino lady luck area just know it's quite a walk and it's all uphill you can always drive it they got free parking here at the red dolly and they'll be happy to accommodate your needs 
I'm pleased. <laughs> Me too.